All right, hey, got some cool stuff today. Uh, my buddy Sam from Brew Calls stopped by, dropped off his cool hat. Yeah, Brew Calls established 2011. Granby, Missouri, local. Man, if you're going to support somebody, support somebody local. And especially support somebody that makes a fine deer call, squirrel call, turkey call, whatever it is. Check that dude out. This is an adjustable reed grunter call. Uh, take that off air. And you can adjust this thing down to whatever whatever call you want to be done. That's probably a doe, I'm going to say. <laughs> Got your doe in there. And young buck all the way up to the big boy. Yeah, love it. And look at that sucker. I believe as light as that is, that's probably red cedar. Beautiful call. Got a, another squirrel collar. Oh, yeah. That sounds good. I don't know, guys. Looks like I might have to... Retire. Old Faithful there. Yeah. We'll be trying this out soon. Been getting a lot of requests for squirrel hunt videos. They're coming, guys. Just hang with me. It's deer season, trapping season, squirrel season. We got so many seasons going on. Woo! Beautiful. Looks like red cedar as well. Got another grunter, another squirrel call. And check this sucker out. Another pot call. Man, that thing is so beautiful. Look at that. Look at this little weird inlay there. Man. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And, of course, a beautiful striker to go with it. Woo! Looks like he's in a little spot there. Let's check it out. tell you what Sam's a great guy and uh, makes a beautiful well sounding call I think the last um, competition he entered I think he got third place and I mean he is working his way up to a dream of his and building you know calls uh, I'm gonna put a link to his uh, Facebook page he does a lot of live videos and videos of him making the calls if you're interested in watching that stuff, it's pretty cool to see. I mean, I love woodworking, so I, I enjoy watching them. Uh, great guy, family man, and just put, makes the most beautiful. I mean, seriously, when I've seen this thing, it looks like it. it's hard to imagine. You have to look at this to appreciate how beautiful it is, and it's like it's under glass it's uh amazing amazing work uh you know this call he sent me years ago still one of my favorites they're just good people and i want to help out those people uh the small guy that's working out of his garage he's got his daytime job and on the nighttime he's working on his dream that's the guy i want to support that's that's how this whole thing should be we should be supporting our local call makers, scent makers. I mean, these people that have jobs, but in the evenings, they just, they're working on their dream. That's who I want to support. And that's who I'm going to continue to support. And it all started with the call. And I believe it looked just like this. Uh, Sam pulled up into my yard, delivering a package for me. 
It was actually a package from, uh, I believe it was Old South Lures, I think, uh, addressed to Wild for the Outdoors, and he pulled up, and I seen this call sitting in his dash. And I said, oh, hey, turkey hunter. He said, I made that. And he picked it up, and I was like, really? <laughs> you made that call? Yeah. Struck up a conversation. Next thing I know, he sends me a box of calls. And uh, ever since then, I've got to watch him working on his dream and get bigger and bigger and bigger and better. And it's just an amazing journey. And I would suggest any of you guys out there, if you're doing this, get involved like that um, you got a local call maker who puts out a great product get with them work with them and help them build on their dream and they'll help you with your dream and man i'll tell you what i'm a that right there that's gonna be my granddaughter's new squirrel call right here uh, <laughs> she can do that she can push a button if she can't now she will soon and i'm gonna take her squirrel hunting and this is gonna be her call for the rest of her life and it is absolutely beautiful just like her so get out there strike up a conversation with somebody you never know i mean this i never thought in a million years i'd be getting these beautiful calls sent to me all because i just struck up a conversation with a guy doing his job but at night after his work's done a daytime job he's working on a dream and uh, i'm gonna wear this hat around with pride not that one because I ain't got it adjusted for my fat head. Get out there to these shows. Let's support these small time people working on a big time dream. Because I'm doing the same thing. Love y'all. God bless. I'll see you on the next one.